Marcel Darius has been traded to the Jacksonville Jaguars for not a second round pick, not a third round pick, not a fourth round pick, not a fifth round pick, but a sixth round pick. Now, when it comes to Darius, obviously he isn't living up to his six year, nearly a hundred million dollar contract. However, he is worth more than a six round pick. And trust me, the Jaguars are look like they're more as if they're a middle of the pack team than they are a bottom, the, the bottom third of the league that they have been, or bottom five, whatever. They, they've been ridiculously down low. It's kind of nice to see the Jaguars kind of lift themselves up. Now, when it comes to Darius and all, he is a pass rusher right here. He has been a little bit disappointing, and the reason why they probably trade him so low was because of his behavioral issues. Now, I would have asked for two draft picks for him at least, at least a fourth round or two, just because I think that would be much more valuable. But hey, I guess behavioral issues really matter in the NFL. And when it comes to the Jaguars, their pass rush legit. You have Clay's Campbell, you have Dante Fowler Jr. Now you put Darius, Darius right there. It's going to be really, really good. And not only that, I think the Bills have been cleaning up shot. They have made a lot of trades. They got rid of Sammy Watkins, and now they might get away Anquan Bolden. Now, Anquan Bolden hasn't really been playing with them and all that. He's actually been in retirement, but he's he's allowed to come back out of retirement and all that. But And I think the Bills will probably trade them. If they do release them, I don't think they want New England just to get – Anquan Bolden for free. I really don't see that happening. So I really think that the train would be the smart move to do if they can't find anyone. Well, I guess they'll have to part ways with him by cutting him. And when it comes to Darius and all that, and the Bills, the Bills and the Jaguars have exceeded expectations this year. And I think when I look at Coughlin, bringing in Darius uh, shows a sign that there's a lot of locker room unity that this Jaguars team is committed right now. And I think one thing for sure about this. Marcel Davis has behavioral issues or has some slight behavioral issues when it comes here and there. I mean, he was just kicked out um, of the training camp for a day back in the summer of the season. So the fact that he's bringing in kind of a guy with behavioral issues shows that the locker room kind of gets it, that there's no behavioral issues. Jack Ray's never really had too many behavioral issues, but bringing Marcel Darius shows that they're not scared to bring in that kind of personnel in the locker room. But what do you guys think? Link is in the description down below if you're interested in reading the article. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.